Welcome back to Jewel Sports Cards. Today we're having one of the first YouTube reviews of a 2022 Donruss Football Blaster Box. It's got 90 cards in it. It's got Josh Allen as the cover boy. And you have six cards per pack, 15 packs per box. That's the, the value that comes here. Uh, what I'm concerned about is the 400 card checklist. 100 rated rookies. There's not 100 rookies in this class that we are excited about pulling. So that means you're going to get a lot of people, maybe even in the press proof variation that you're not jacked about. But I think it's cool that they have this new blaster exclusive crunch time and production line inserts. Good job by them. Obviously, the optic rated rookie hollow parallel is something that people love out of Donruss. And then everyone's asking, can you pull downtowns out of it? Do you see the word? There you are. There you are, folks. So you can. They're not the traditional downtown. They are more Super Bowl themed, which I think is unique and good, right? You have to pivot, adapt, or perish. You can't keep going on in the exact same way. But if you are watching this video right now, I would love if you would subscribe. Jewel Sports Cards. Actually, I said that wrong. It's six packs and 15 cards per pack. My apologies for that false info that is corrected. That's what I try to bring here on Jewel Sports Cards. A correct approach. I'll give you that. To reviewing product. Because I know we're all looking and thinking, do I want to open this? My initial gut is that I will have this be my only blaster that I rip of Donruss football this year. Um, number one, the design's not the hottest. And some of the photos are actually similar to that of what Absolute already had. Now, Walter Payton wasn't in Absolute. That's stinking dope. I like that one, actually. Um, Davis Mills. I mean, there's a bigger checklist, so you're going to get some new. But also, like, did we need an Adafe Oa, Greg Russo, you know, second year defensive lineman cards here? Slay Bebe, Abby needed. Cameron Hayward. Carry on, my Cameron Hayward son. Nailed it. Um, you know, and they have just so many veterans that are retired now with a 400 checklist set. Okay, yeah, Perry and Winfrey. Literally a, just a bigger, closer picture of his absolute one. Hey, there we go. We got a Walker rookie. Rated rookie. Kenneth Walker. I-I-I captain. And here we got our production line, which like kind of looks cool, but it's also just a defense alignment card right there. So sack 16. Um, they, they did a good job on it. I just don't know how much hype is going to happen on the line, right? So glad you could see the new blaster exclusive. Um, but honestly, the, the Kenneth Walker so far is probably... Let's adjust that right there a little bit. Probably what you care about more, um, which is sad because you want to be excited about the product that you pull. Um, this is a new one, and we've been waiting for it for a minute. And with that, you just hope that there's a little bit more pizzazz than that. Now, I hope I get a crunch time, too. I'm not sure that I will, um, just because of the fact that they're only probably going to be so many rooms for so much inserts. I mean, there's like an insert card at the end of each pack. And so there's going to be the Elite Series. There's going to be some of the other ones that maybe aren't as snazzy that you're probably going to get. I mean, Grady Jarrett. Speaking of snazzy. Skylar Thompson, not a bad one. Uh, he's gotten starts. He's a rookie QB. David Bell, Purdue's own. Um, there's the Rooks. There's the Pierre Strong Jr. we were all looking for. And then there's a kid reporter. I, I want to show you the code because I want to help. I can't. Panini, come on. You knew this wasn't going to be released until after the Super Bowl. You know that last year there was the fiasco of so many kid reporter cards just never making it out of the pack. It's just, like, kind of embarrassing. It, it really looks like you don't have your stuff together when you have that big of a misprint that early. I mean, it's like there's going to be something else that has it, too. If 
if this has it, I'm sure they were just lining up everything. What are your thoughts, Adam? Yeah, just way too many cards here that people don't care about. It's like, I'm stoked on a Mike Allstead, uh, Madden 04, 92 overall ranking. But most people aren't. They're just going to keep it pushing. Cam Thomas. Wrong Cam Thomas, by the way. Loki, if it was the Nets, people would be popping off. Uh, Kyron Williams. I, I like the Fighting Irish, so kind of cool to see him. But most people don't care, and no insert on that one. Only making the quest for crunch time. Which is a cereal reference, by the way. It's like a Captain Crunch-looking cereal box. Um, which I think is cool. You got to be... Trying to grow the hobby any way you can. I mean, that's why the Marvel cards were so smart. Because you pull in some people that maybe don't have a huge care about athletes. But love Marvel or comics. And they kind of start looking at that. And yeah, it's, I don't know. Dan Fouts fans aren't going to buy this product because he's in the checklist. Vita Ve fans, they're not going to buy this card. <laughs> it's, it's tough, man. So many of these cards. I mean... I'm, and I'm pulling, I'm actually pulling heat on the rookies. This is another rated rookie QB, uh, Sam Howell. My Vikes first overall pick who just had his leg, leg explode, Louis Seen. An elite series Malik Willis. I mean, I honestly couldn't be pulling more fire on just like the standard stuff. And still, I'm like crickets on this. Um, it, it's so downtown heavy for you to get value out of it um and just the design i don't think is cool enough to really excited about the financial gains i mean aaron Rodgers, you can't even really tell that's him uh, there's just too many names to say that aren't like ones that we really care about too i mean the 45 million dollar man obviously people are stoked on but just way too many defensive players slash like <laughs> non-elite Running backs. I'm not trying to call you out, Kenyon Drake, but Trey Hendrickson gets paid more than you. Hey, Minnesota's own Golden Gopher, Antoine Winford Jr., Alec Pierce, position player, and here's our red press proof. This is not numbered. Dalton Schultz, a Dalton Schultz press proof. Um, could be worse to be honest. Could be a lot better. Last pack mojo. I'm just going to kind of admit it's not going to happen. Um, you can pull autos. You can pull mems. You can pull a lot of stuff out of this. But the word can is one of those that will just always get us, right? <laughs> the hope of what could be. And I just think there's a lot more fun product. Like Chronicles, right? Chronicles, you just don't know what you're going to get. Trevon Diggs. Um, that ball. Uh, that football literally looks like it's a part of the this field. <laughs> looks like Josh Allen's just got his hand in a really weird position for no reason whatsoever. Anyways, as I'm coming down here with my cam, and it's like you have cam in your combine pick. And Romeo Dobbs, not bad. The Dobbs there actually matters. And we got a portrait. Ooh, these portraits are cool. Um, they feel like a, a Diamond Kings, a Gridiron Kings card that look at really cool that they did the portrait style. I mean, TDP, not the exact name you're looking for, but something. And to get it three to rookie. Um, best card of the rip, <laughs> which honestly I would call it, rest in peace. Um, not any of those three. So it's the best rookie you got. Um, I mean, Malik, you got him in the shine, but I think all of us are pretty hesitant on um, that dude being that dude. It's it's gotta be Skylar Thompson or or Kenneth Walker who actually had relevancy for teams with relevancy, right? That's my opinion. So a couple of raid rookies that actually I feel good about. Honestly, if you ripped the pack of this, I would expect you to not get as many raid rookies that you would be excited about. The thing is it's it's this, right? So if you want to set collect, hey, you got a long way to go because <laughs> four hundred of them. But you can do it pretty quick out of a blaster here. Um, they reduced the prices from what they were previously. Um, I think they're market correcting, which is a little bit nice. But my official recommendation, hit them with it. X, go and give it to you. Do not buy. Um, I say it because I love you guys. And I want you to put money towards really fun product. I, I'm a big Diamond Kings guy. I know that's probably not most of your cup of tea. But find something you love and purchase it. If you really want to get it downtown, 
spend the money that you would on ripping blasters and just go buy a single of it. Santa, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Um, we're getting out of winter, so that's positive. But if you want to go back, time travel, back to the future, Christopher Lloyd on it, go buy a single of Santa on eBay. Never thought I'd say that as a sentence. Please follow me on TikTok, Joel Sports Cards, on Twitter, Joel Sports Cards. If you're still watching this video and you haven't hit the sub button, what are you doing? You're supporting the channel. You like the content. I'd love for you to stick around more. Until next time, y'all, keep ripping. Peace. Love that my coffee got a little peek there at the end.